Definitely, as yeah. the uh, week progresses, right, Matt? You're exactly right. If you like the cooler weather, stick around the next couple of days. You're going to be happy. But if you like that summer-like weather, like Erica was mentioning, this coming weekend, we're going to feel the heat once again. We're not done with the 90s. We usually probably try to hit 90, at least 91, 92, about once to two, about two times in the month of October on average. We're probably going to do that this weekend. Uh, but we want to talk about kind of a recap as we went through this past weekend, the, fa the past weekend of the first weekend of October. And we picked up some rain, right? We got the good downpours. We got some thunderstorms. And I have some good news. Crawford County, we no longer have that burn ban in place, but we still have one in Sebastian County and LaFleur County. The reason why is where we got most of the rain the past five days. The bright yellow and orange and even red color show you the bullseyes of where we got some of the rain. We got hit pretty much really, really hard in Benton County. That's where we had some of the heaviest rain this week, especially west of Bentonville towards Centerton, Bella Vista, uh, Gentry, Decatur. We got a lot of that heavy rain, a little bit less towards Beaver Lake, uh, south into Washington County. A lot of us try to pick up about an inch or so. In the River Valley, Crawford County, no longer do we have that burn ban. I mean, look, we got hit hard from Van Buren northbound into Dean Springs. Uh, Alma, we got the heavy rain, and then we had a, a good swath right along I-40 and then just south of I-40 near the Arkansas River where we picked up the most rain. And then towards the south, Sebastian County, where we still have a burn ban, we, we got a little bit of rain but not the most. A lot of us try to pick up maybe close to an inch, so not enough to quite cancel a burn ban. Same story in LaFleur County. Poto, we picked up about an inch or so for some of us, so we could still use more rain. Temperatures this afternoon, we're seeing in the 70s in northwest Arkansas, some 80s throughout the River Valley. We get a drop of rain today. We had beautiful blue sky. That cold front came in this past weekend and really knocked out the humidity. Things were really, really nice today, weren't they? A little warm, but otherwise the humidity wasn't there. We've got clear skies right now, really no clouds. Those clouds that we had throughout the afternoon continue to fade away. The front that we had this weekend also pushes off towards the east. We've got high pressure. Most of these days are going to be mostly sunny this first full week of October. There's a chance for a stray shower on Wednesday, but otherwise things are pretty dry. This evening, as you're headed out the door, temperatures will quickly drop into the 70s, 60s, and then overnight tonight, waking up tomorrow morning, Meteorologist Tyler Moore is going to have some cool temperatures with you tomorrow. We'll be waking up in maybe some upper 40s in northwest Arkansas, mid-50s in the River Valley. That's a nice time, part of this year, right? This time of year where we start in the 40s and 50s, even though we'll head towards sometimes the 80s tomorrow afternoon. But at least the mornings feel really, really refreshing. Here's a look at Futurecast. Overnight tonight, no weather concerns. We'll have mostly clear skies. Waking up tomorrow morning more, mostly clear skies there. There could be a little bit of patchy fog, but... Tuesday looks nice. Now, by Tuesday afternoon, we'll get a couple more clouds coming in from the east, and we may try to pick up a stray shower on Wednesday, but the rain chances are super, super low. Also, the humidity is super, super low tomorrow, and then it slowly starts to go back up this coming weekend, and there's that heat. We're going to get a warm front to come in by Friday this weekend. 90s back in the forecast for portions of Arkansas and Oklahoma. You see that bump in the temperature by the end of this week and in this coming weekend. Northwest Arkansas, it's going to be close. We'll try to flirt with 90. River Valley, it's not much of a question. I think we'll be in the low to mid 90s. Basically, the question is how far in the 90s are we going to go? That'll be Saturday. But then I think by next week, we'll have a cold front that pushes through. So this heat will be temporary, but the 90s aren't over yet. I guess the only thing good about that on Saturday is that the sun sets around, what, 6-ish now? 6.30, yeah. so it yeah, doesn't it's last all the way into the evening, but it's still. True. Yeah, that 3, 4 o'clock, whatever you got going yeah. on, it's going to be toasty. Yeah, oh my goodness. It's, it's going to feel more like September night than yeah. October night. Yeah. Huh? Right yeah. All right, Matt, thanks. We'll still ahead.